Hey guys, Mr. Pickles here, and I'm going to give you guys a tutorial today on how to do that explosion shot that I know you guys have heard in like a lot of COD montages. It's, it's, it's used quite a lot, and I honestly never knew how to do it, and until I just went into Sony Vegas and just fiddled around with it, I finally figured it out. It only took me like 10 minutes, because really, it's, it's actually just really easy to do. So, what you're going to need, you're going to need your clip, obviously, of you killing someone and shooting them. And uh, you're gonna also going to need your audio clip of some sort of explosion. Just go to Google and type in explosion mp3 and then just download an explosion. Mine is a grenade explosion. I'll let you guys listen to it. So, that's what it is. And... I just downloaded that off of Google. That's like the I just typed in like explosion and yeah, that popped up. Anyway, so this is how you're gonna get that deep like sound that that like syncs up with like in a song with the bass drop. It it just sounds really good. Anyway, so this is how you do it. You're gonna click this little button, track effects, and you're gonna want to go to the tab track EQ, and you're going to want to increase these numbers. You're just gonna click them and drag them up. Drag them up, not too high, just to about the middle. And they're all going to want to be at the same height. And then you can go here and mess with this a little bit if you want to. Drag that up to about there, and this over here, and this over here. It's just whatever you think uh, sounds best to, to you. And then, after you're done with that, just... What I usually do is I slow down the clip, the audio clip, because I just think it sounds better. So, go to the end of your clip, Hold control and drag it out. Uh, I would say just drag it out to about there. And then it's going to sound really weird if you play it. So you're going to want to go to properties and pitch change lock to stretch. And it sounds tons, tons, tons better. And let's see how this sounds. Alright, well it's it's pretty deep. I'll probably, I'm going to have to slow it down a little bit more because it's not quite deep enough. So just drag it out a little bit more and let's hear it again. Yeah, that's about what we're looking for. So anyway, you want to go to your clip now and sync it up with the shot. So just the explosion begins about right there, I believe. And then it should just sync up and sound pretty good. You, you might want to increase the decibels of this a little bit so it'll... Okay, so it's a little... Alright, here we go. Just right there. Alright, and so this is it. And it sounds better with music, obviously. But that's how you get that explosion shot. And uh, it was really easy to do. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Thanks.